Come, let me show you our guest hut. We can stay for dinner. That should do it. <laughs> oh no. Now what am I gonna do? Oh, the banana picker. I need this for, uh, what's his name? Where did you just shove that? Ahoy, mateys. What's up? Welcome back to The Secret of Monkey Island. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. Hope you're having a great day. If you missed the last episode, we've got our crew and our ship. We made our way all the way to Monkey Island, and now we are in search of LeChuck and in search of Governor Marley. Hopefully they're not going to be too hard to track down, but if you've missed any of the previous episodes, I hope you'll check out the playlist to get caught up. But either way, I still hope you enjoyed this episode of The Secret of Monkey Island. <laughs> hey, who are you? Toothrot? Hi, I'm Herman Toothrot. Yeah. Don't bother to say hello. Help me, I've Herman. I've been waiting 20 years to talk to somebody civilized. I don't mind. Fine. By the way, you might want to think about putting out that fire. Someone I know, help me. Hurt. Oh, I just had to stand up and the fire went out. Notice of public meeting. There will be a meeting Wednesday evening to discuss the recent occupation of the sacred monkey head by the ghost pirate LeChuck. And the subsequent impact on the environment and the tourist trade. All Monkey Island cannibals are encouraged to attend. Yeah, all right, we're encouraged to attend. Yeah, I'll just take that banana along the beach here. Anything? No. Nothing at all. What's along the beach of this way? Anything? Not a thing. Ain't no thing. So I guess let's just go back into the jungle here. Deep. Dark. Forbidding. I'm trying to see where we can go. We can go to the crack. Monkey, monkey. Okay, there's some oars down here. It's a pair of oars, and I can't reach that from here. Can't reach that from here, guys. I need to find some stuff, I guess. I don't see anything special about it. Oh, hello, giant bird. Oh, another giant bird. Can we get in the boat and, and go? That's strange. It says sea monkey. Sea monkey do what? I don't have anything to paddle with. Oh, I need the oars. Okay. I guess uh, let's go the back in. Dark. Forbidding. Go back into the jungle. I've gotta be able to go somewhere else around here. Okay, what's this place? Looks like there's a crater or a volcano or something.
Anything up here? I have no idea where I'm supposed to be going. Brush. Okay. Boy, it sure is hot here. Is it? Well, I'm no geologist, but judging by these conchoidal fractures, I'd say this is a piece of flint. Can I take that? Well, I'll check out this note while I'm at it. Yeah. But it's take the flint. On letterhead. <laughs> to the ghost pirate LeChuck. We must ask you once again to curtail your nightly activities in the sacred monkey head area. Decent people are trying to sleep. Kindly keep the noise level down. The Monkey Island Cannibals. P.S. We saw you taking that woman with the scarf down there. Oh. That's valuable information. But can I come up here? Looks like it's safe to climb. To the Monkey Island Cannibals. Please stop moving this. It is delicately balanced. Herman Toothrot. Okay. Okay, he said not to move it, so let's move it. Does that do anything? I don't know. What's over here? Oh, look at this view. It's beautiful. I can see the banana tree. I can see the boat. Excuse me, I can see my ship. Look at this. Oh, is this Herman? Are you back? Ah, I never get tired of this view. It's a great Even view. Even if I have been looking at it for 20 years now. Even if it is the only view on the island. <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> yes, it is a nice view. Um, I'm afraid I must be going now. Oh, that was... Pressing business, you know. <laughs> that was brief. <laughs> There's a big old heap of rocks here. Let's pick them up. What would I want with a big rock? Yeah, I don't know. Put it in your pocket. I can't move it. You take it. Take it later. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. <gasps> wow. Looked like it hit the big banana tree on the beach. Nice. I bet the odds against that are incredible. <laughs> Can I really not do anything with these rocks? Um, I don't see anything special about it. I guess not. There's nothing special about it anyway. Look, there's another note. Is it from Herman? Because we just moved it. Mr. Toothrot, please remove this dangerous object. Hmm. Lemonhead knocked a rock onto it from the cliff above and nearly sank a passing ship. Whoa. The cannibals. <laughs> Wouldn't they want it to sink a passing ship? You know what I mean? Boy, it sure is hot here. Sure is hot here. Um, let's come back over this way. Oh, 
let's let's look at this. There's a dam here. Well, I don't see anything special about it. Nothing special about it, though. All right. Back from whence we came. Dry riverbed. This this is where we just were. Boy, it sure right? is hot yeah. here. Just trying to find um, any other places I can go. Come on, guy brush. What's over this way? There's a clearing. Private. Private property. Worshiping okay. is permitted, but please do not enter the monkey head. Oh. Uh, GP LeChuck. I say this is where LeChuck is, isn't it? Let's take a peek. Oh, this looks ominous. Beep. <laughs> knock a knock. Let's check, let's check. I'm gonna have to find uh, something for this totem pole, I'm sure. Let's take a look at this. Beep. Beep. Shish kebab. Shish kebab. Shish kejo. <laughs> uh, shish kejo. Not Joe too. All right. Beach. Hey, looky here, looky here. There's a message in it. Of course there is. It's a memo. To Herman Toothrot, from Yammer, Hem, and Haw, Attorneys at Law. Uh-oh. Regarding suit against Cannibal Tribe over malicious tossing of your oars into a chasm. Hmm. I think we have a case here. <laughs> we can probably soak them for emotional distress and possibly punitive damages as well. Nice. Hmm. Sounds like legalese. <laughs> I don't think I can translate the rest. Herman's in for a big payday. Look at that fabulous ship out there. That's mine. Don't touch Did it. You come in that? You're braver than you look. <laughs> you Actually, bet I am. It looks a lot like a ship I used to own. Nope. Uh, what do you mean braver than I look? What do you mean braver than I look? Oh, nothing. Never mind. Are you some kind of a castaway? What do I look like? The caretaker? <laughs> Listen to this guy. Am I some kind of castaway? <laughs> Here, man. Um. I thought this island was uninhabited. Let's get a little lower. Well, you thought wrong. My name's Toothrot. Herman Toothrot. I live here. Well, not right here. <laughs> in the fort on the volcano. Oh. Were you stranded? You think I stay here for my health? Oh, boy. I didn't see a fort at the volcano, but you probably need to check well, that out. Well, special about it. Is there anything else on the uh, beach anywhere? I mean, I don't see anything else. Just walk to jungle. Okay, let's go back over and uh, visit the fort. Where is the fort? Your fort? Oh, there the it is. Ends here. Nice. Found it. Rope. Spyglass. Cannon. Oh. Okay. Hey, 
Nice spyglass. Looks just like... Say, where is my spyglass? I haven't seen oh, it. Oh, perfect. I'm gone five minutes and somebody comes in here and dumps gunpowder all over the floor. <laughs> Naturally, I don't think you had anything to do with it. I'm sure it's just a coincidence that you came in here to prowl around right after some mysterious person dirtied up my nice clean floor. Yeah, that's just a coincidence. I saw a monkey leaving here. He must have done it. You don't fool me, Sonny. Oh, come on. How did you get stranded here? Well, I sailed here with a friend of mine 20 years ago. We hope to discover the secret of Monkey Island. But my friend met with a horrifying and tragic accident, which claimed his life. And I couldn't sail a ship back by myself. I trained a bunch of chimps to crew the ship and sail it back to Melee Island. They were supposed to get help and come back for me. There's something must have happened. Mm-hmm. Sure How did. You didn't just go with the chimps. Yeah. Weeks on a boat full of monkeys. Uh, true. Oh, oh joy! <laughs> You're the only one on the island. I'm the only civilized person on the island. There's a native tribe of hunter-gatherers. Well, head-hunter-gatherers, actually. But I don't talk to them. They are cannibals, but they're not dangerous. Are you Unless sure? Unless you lend them something. What happened to your pants? Yeah. What pants? Exactly. <laughs> uh... Did you lend something to the cannibals? I lent my banana picker to them, and they never gave it back. Okay. As collateral, they gave me this enormous cotton swab. It opens the big monkey head idol they worship. Can I have it? Not like I ever need to go into the monkey head. But if they want it back, I've got to have my picker first. It's a matter of pride, you know. Hmm. All right, I'm going to have to... Uh... Why don't you just give me the key to the monkey head? I'm going to have to steal the picker. No, I needed to get back my banana picker. Yeah. I'm Guybrush. I'm here to rescue someone. Well, here I am. <laughs> Not Glad you. You came to rescue me. The governor. Though you might have been a bit earlier. <laughs> the find on that overdue library book should be pretty big by now. Yeah, you might as well just keep it. Let's go. Um, that's not exactly what I meant. I sailed here in pursuit of the governor of Melee Island, who's been kidnapped by a ghost. Oh, fine. Don't rescue me. I like it here. The rain on my head, the wind at my back, the bugs on my plate. Um, well, perhaps I could take you back, too. But I've got to rescue the governor first. I think she's on that ghost ship underground. Oh, okay. I told you <laughs> about them borrowing my banana picker and never returning it, right? Yeah, you told me. All right. Excuse me, I've got some pressing business to attend to. Yes, me too. <laughs> Can I uh, pick this up while he's here? I'll help you clean up. Did I get some gunpowder? Well, I've got enough. Okay, we did. All right, bye, Herman. Okay, so let's go back over to the dam. Because we should be able to break that open with either the cannonball or the gunpowder. I think that's here. Boy, it sure is hot here. Actually... Before we do that, let me come over here and just see if I can look in the dry riverbed. See if there's anything here that I need to. There's a pond. To the Monkey Island Cannibals. There we go. I don't mind you worshipping in front of the sacred monkey idol, which doubles as my home and secret base of operations. But could you please refrain from leaving messy sacrifices on my porch? Also, please do not enter the monkey head. It's been very specific Lichard. about that. 
Herman, go away. This is an old friend of mine, the one I shared here with. Oh, no. What'd you do to him? Wait. Never looked better. <laughs> what happened to him? Oh, nasty accident. Yeah. He was trying to put up a swing. Oh. Excuse me, I've got some pressing business to attend to. Yeah, please leave. Yes, me too. <laughs> he doesn't look good. He does not look good. Wonder if I can get in this. He stuff. doesn't look good. Doesn't he look doesn't like look it. good. All right, we'll have to come back here probably after we um, release Boy, the dam. Sure is hot here. Okay. Let me see what I got in my inventory. So we did pick up several things here. Spyglass, I'm not sure what that's for. We got a banana. As I said, it's flint. Okay, it's flint. Um, oh, let's use... Gunpowder. Okay. Use... Flint with. Do I have steel on here somewhere? Mm, or just a solid rock? Flint works best with things made of steel. Okay, use plant with cannibal. Oh, there we go. Okay, so let's go back down here and see uh, if we can get to that guy now. Yeah, there he is. Got some rope. He doesn't look good. He still doesn't look good. Anything else in here that I need? Doesn't look like it. Okay. So now where do we want to go? Can we, since we have the rope, can we go get the oars now? Back to the crack, I say. Let's use our rope. Yes. Okay, sturdy stump. So now we can use our other Looks rope straight. with this. Come on down here and pick these up. It's a pair of oars. Yeah, take them. Okay, let's uh, let's get out of here. So now we can take the boat. There's two bananas. Banana, banana. Actually pick them up. Banana, banana. All right, now we should be able to use the boat. I can paddle it with these oars. I know you can. So get in. There you go. Now you're moving. Uh, let's come around this way. Come on, Guybrush, you can do it. Paddle, paddle, paddle. He's moving against the current. There he goes.
Move your rowboat. All right, there's gotta be stuff up here. There's another beach. Herman, please return our key to the monkey head. The cannibals. <laughs> These, Herman and the cannibals and uh, LeChuck all have this little passive aggressive thing going on here. Okay, I can walk to the jungle. I don't see anything special about it. I know you don't. Um, where do we want to go, though? I think we want to go over here. Let's check out the cannibals' village and hope they don't eat me. No! Come back here. Hmm. It's an empty hut. Yep. Still empty. <laughs> okay. I'll look around town a little bit. This hut is very empty. What about this one? Boy, this is the emptiest hut I've ever seen. No two ways about it. This hut's empty. Oh, boy. Banana! I don't want to get any closer to that thing. Really? It might be booby-trapped. That's true. Now you're thinking. Hmm. This door appears to be locked. Appears to be locked. Okay. What are we gonna do about that? Uh, hello, boys. Is that a banana in your pocket, or are you just glad to see us? Yeah. You've got a lot of nerve stealing from the notorious Monkey Island cannibals. <laughs> you're cannibals? Well, yes. Although lately, we've been trying to stay away from red meat. Oh, that's a relief. Only for health reasons. <laughs> We're still as vicious as ever. Okay. Oh, especially with tourists who try to steal our stuff for souvenirs. Like what? Well, what do you have to say for yourself? I didn't take anything. Don't eat me. I'm a mighty pirate. That means his skin will be leathery and his meat tough and the stringy. Yeah. You're of no use to us, <laughs> nutritionally speaking. But if you had some sort of offering for us, something that we could pass on to the great monkey, well... Um, like what? You want to give him, um, a spyglass? Nothing to look at here. Obviously, you have nothing for us. Okay, guess not. We might eat you, <laughs> we might let you go. Mm -hmm. We'll have to talk about it with the village nutritionist. Come, let me show you our guest hut. We can stay for dinner. That should do it. <laughs> oh, no. Now what am I going to do? Oh, the banana picker. I need this for, uh, what's his name? Where did you just shove that? Cannibals. I'm not giving you bloodsuckers your key to the monkey head until you return my banana picker. H.T. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's look at this thing. Can I move it? Huh. Looks loose. Okay, so, uh, can I pull it? Yeah. I might fit through that hole, but I don't think this banana picker will. Oh. Wait, what? Hmm. I guess we're just gonna no, sneak out of here. I'm not getting squeamish. I'd love to eat the guy. So let's do it. But think of your arteries. We are cannibals for crying out loud. Yeah, but cannibals have to watch their saturated fats just like everyone else. <laughs> All right. That was silly, but that was fun. Okay. So what do I need to do? I need to get something to give the cannibals. But I can't take the banana picker with me to get the thing from um, Herman. 
Let's get back in our boat. Back to the boat. All right. Um, let's come see this monkey. I don't know what the vultures do either. They didn't seem to have anything. Like I couldn't really click on them. Let's come back in the jungle. Monkey. Want a monkey? You want a banana monkey? Not until he comes down. Banana. It doesn't seem to open. I can't open the banana? Banana. Banana. <gasps> Banana! Banana! I'm out of bananas. I don't know. Is there anything special about it? Is my pet now? Come on, monkey. Come on, monkey. Let's go to the monkey head. Okay. Okay, so let's figure out this totem here. I can't move it. Nice. Oh. Ah, oh, thanks, monkey. the second biggest monkey head I've ever seen. <laughs> second biggest? What? Oh. It looks like a sacred idol of some kind. Okay. It looks like a sacred idol of some kind. Okay. Hmm. Oh. What a cheap piece of mass-produced tourist crap. On the bottom it says, Made by Lemonhead. This is much too heavy to pick up. Let alone carry around this godforsaken island for God knows what reason. This is much too heavy to pick up. This is much too heavy to pick up. Let alone carry around this godforsaken island for God knows what reason. Okay, so we're gonna have to pick up the little one. The wimpy little one. I doubt anyone will miss this piece of junk. Okay, so this is like where the cannibals were worshiping at. They're giving him these idols. So we should be able to go back to the cannibals and give them this so that they can give it to the monkey head. And then hopefully they'll give me the, the, the banana picker so that I can give that to Herman to get the cotton swab. That's my plan. All right, I gotta go get my boat. All right, back to the beach. Back to the jungle. Back to the village. Hello. Hello, boys. Hmm, this door appears to be locked. Still locked. Hey, fellas. Ah, the banana thief returns to the scene of the crime. You don't know Maybe nothing. Maybe we should just eat him right now. Do you have any idea how much cholesterol is in one of these things? <laughs> 
Now then, how did you break out of our hut, and why did you come back? Well... Don't eat me. I'll give you anything. Anything? Sure. Hmm. We'll give you one more chance to trade something of yours for your freedom. Well... How about this little idol? Hey, wow, this is impressive. Lemonhead, <laughs> take a look at this. It's one that you Ooh, made. Oh, that's nice. And it says, made by Lemonhead, just <laughs> like one of mine. Yeah. We should take this to the great monkey. Yes, I agree. We are very grateful to you for this fine gift. If there's anything you need on Monkey Island, just come see us. All right. Can I have the banana picker? Please. Thank you. All right. Where am I going to find Hermit at? The fort? There he is, there he is. Back. Nice. But will they give it to me? They want the monkey head key back first. Ha! That'll be the day. Give it to me, please. Don't you think they're being unreasonable? Yes. So I'm asking for a lot. Okay. He's done talking now. Herman. 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 Hi. Oh. Hi. I was just looking for the natives to get them to return my banana picker. Got you covered, bud. But I can't seem to find them. I have your banana picker. Hey, thanks. Give me the key. I'd never see this again. Here, you can take this key to the monkey head back to the natives. Thank you. Okay. And don't worry, I won't use it or anything. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. Excuse me, I've got some pressing business to attend to. Yes, me too. <laughs> so just the way that they said if you need anything on Monkey Island, we're probably going to have to come back to the cannibals for something. But for now, let's go to the monkey head. And uh, at least open the doors and get inside. We're gonna make LeChuck pretty mad. All right, let's get in here. All right, let's use this cotton swab. I bet we have to use it on the monkey's ear, right? Doesn't that make sense? <laughs> oh, that sounds so gross. Nice. Why, that's the second biggest monkey head I've ever seen. Oh. I had a feeling that in hell there would be mushrooms. <laughs> okay. Uh. Don't fall in. Oh, 
How do I? I can't reach it. Where do I go? Hmm. Well, that didn't really make any sense. Maybe um, the villagers said if we need something, we should come back. Maybe the villagers have something to get through here. Let's just go back and talk to them and see if they're there. Or maybe I need to look at one of the books I got from uh, the boat for my ship. Have you come back to let us repay you for your fine gift? Yes, please. Well, actually, there is something. Tell us, what is it? I'm looking for the governor. I'm looking for somebody. Here? On Monkey Island? Ooh. We're the only people living on Monkey Island. Well, the only civilized people. <laughs> um, the people I'm looking for aren't living... People I'm looking for aren't civilized. I'm looking for 30 dead guys and one woman. That's I'm true. For 30 dead guys and one woman. <laughs> I don't think I want to hear any more about it. Oh. Wait, maybe he's talking about those dead pirates. Yeah, LeChuck. Oh, yeah. Those guys. Then you've seen the ghost pirate LeChuck and his cadaverous crew? Cadaverous. That's a good word. Those jerks have been bugging us for months. Zooming around here in that creepy ghost ship of theirs, wailing and moaning until all hours of the morning. Scaring away all the cruise ship business? <laughs> Normally, when we have problems with the undead, we just cook up our standard potion of exorcism and be done with it. Oh. Uh, yeah, give me the potion. Give me the potion. I'll use it on LeChuck. I'll get rid of him for you. We can't. Oh. Why? Well, the main ingredient of the potion is a very rare root. In fact, oh, there's that's only right. one in existence. And it's on we his only ship. use a little bit at a time, you see. But the Chuck stole the whole thing. Yeah, I remember that. Where is he hiding it? He's in a place beneath this island. Somewhere in a huge system of catacombs. A hellish place filled with the wailing of tortured souls trapped forever in the rock where the walls bleed and the air is thick with the rancid smell of pure evil. Tourists used to line up for hours to see it. Chuck came and ruined everything, right? Yep. No, we lost the key. Aww. It was stolen. Well, we loaned it to a hermit who lives on the island. And until that crusty old pantless weirdo brings it back, we're keeping his banana picker. Hmm, okay. All right. So then let's I'm go find him. Find the Chuck and get the root. Sorry, but it's just not that easy. Oh, why not? Trying to find LeChuck could be very dangerous. You'd never find your way through the catacombs without the... The what? Hey, <laughs> Ixnay on the Ed Hay of the Avigator Nay. W the what? Nothing. Big Latin. Yeah, what is the Ed Hay of the Avignator and Nay? <laughs> What's the Ed Hay of the Avigator Nay? I see he is baffled by our native dialect. Good. <laughs> we could at least tell him what the head does. Well, it's a navigating tool. It's a head. It was once attached to a navigator. Oh. We've kept it alive magically so we could take advantage of its innate sense of direction. Getting mm. through the catacombs without it is impossible. But it's our only one, so you can't have it. Please. I guess 
We have nothing to offer you. After he gave us that nice idol, too. Feel free to come to the Great Monkey and visit your idol anytime. Okay, I have to so, steal it, don't I? Anyway, Lemonhead, what was that you were saying about tropical oils? Well... Mm. Um... What is, what are these? I may be able to use one of these. It's called how to get a leg up in treasure hunting. Oh. It's called how to get a head in navigating. Oh, head navigating. Oh, yeah. Um, let's give it to these guys. Well, look at this. It looks like instructions on how to get a head. <laughs> we could give him our head and use these instructions to get ourselves a new one. <laughs> yes, I suppose we can give you this now. Thank you. Thanks. Looks pretty good for a dried up old head, doesn't it? Not bad, not bad. <laughs> we keep it wrapped in this magical necklace that makes it invisible to ghosts. I think he likes you. Me too. Just follow his nose and he'll lead you to LeChuck's hideout in the catacombs. Then get the root from LeChuck and come back here. We'll mix up a batch of our special enzymatic ghost dissolving solution. And you can pour it on LeChuck like salt on a slug. Awesome. Yeah. That sounds Good cool. Luck. Okay. Back to the skull. You're doing a great job, monkey buddy. Keep it up. Okay. Let's come down here. And let's, um... Can we talk to this thing? Hello, Mr. Navigator. Yes. Hello. <laughs> okay. Uh... Let's use it. I assume we have to follow this thing's directions, right? Is it going to point the way that we should go? This way? This way? I think it wants me to go to the right. Okay. Okay, back, back, um, left, cave, I guess, maybe not, okay, oh, found it. I'm coming, Governor Marley. Elaine, I'm here. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? Uh... <laughs> uh, let's see here. Is this the lighter tech? Come to interrogate the prisoner. I've come to interrogate the prisoner. <laughs> oh no. Oh. Um, so what do I do here? Let's um, talk to this guy again and see if he has any instructions. Maybe he just says hello again. Okay, we're here. <laughs> now what do you want from me? Hmm. Thank you. Thank you for leading me to the ghost ship. Hey, no problem. <laughs> when you only have one job, I like this you do guy. it well. 
Know what I mean? Yes, I do. Uh, may I please have your necklace? May I please have that necklace? No, but thanks for asking so politely. You're welcome. Please. Oh, come on, please. You can beg all you want, but you can't have it. Mm. Pretty please? You can beg all you want, but you can't have it. I'm just going to keep asking till you give it to me. Pretty, pretty, please? You can beg all you want, but you can't have it. Pretty, please, with sugar on top? <laughs> well, we can go on all day. Oh, all right, you big baby. <laughs> Thank you. You can have it. Hey, what good's a necklace if you don't have shoulders? True. <laughs> I like this guy. Can I wear it, please? This feels weird. Okay. I'm, oh, I'm invisible. What was that? Nothing. Nobody here. Okay, I gotta find the root. That. Can I get in? Hmm. Guess not. Can I come down here? Anything special about it? He looks sound asleep. Can I have his? That up. Have his grog? Guess not. Looks like a bottle full of grog. I can't get it away from him. Hmm. I don't see anything special about it. Look at all those chickens. Look at all those chickens. They look like chickens. All I got was a feather. Okay. I'm sure, I can use that for something. Pick that up. Hmm. I can't get inside it. It's nailed, chained, bolted, roped, glued, and welded together. It's locked tight. Must be oh. something important down there. My goodness. So what do I have? I've got flint still. yourself and see that. All right, let's see if we can uh, let's see if we can tickle this guy with the feather. Right, because he's sleeping. So let's just go in here. Open. Oh. I don't like that he's in here. Oh, uh, what do I do? 
Um, and I don't have anything. The wind makes not such a creaking. Strange places, strange noises. Um. What else is in here? Fear for thy life, he who enters. Nobody here. You better fear. Looks like Monkey Island. Looks like Monkey Island. That doesn't seem to work. I can't pick that up. Hmm. Ugh, no thanks. <laughs> okay. So how do I get this key? What do I have here? Let's see. Stable remover. That's LeChuck's note. Compass. Oh. So if I pull this out, will this, is it going to pull the key to me? Let's try. Nice. Okay, so let's go back and... That probably unlocks the um, hatch. Wonder if that's where the root is. Yes. Okay, rats everywhere. Yikes! Ooh. I hate rats. Okay. Here, rat has a feather. Yikes! I hate rats. Yikes! I hate rats. Uh, have some grog. I think I'd rather save it. Have a skull. Trap him. Give him a feather? I don't think he wants that. Okay, he wants he wants grog. I'll just pour it in this dish. Yeah. Ugh, it's all over my hands. Grease. Got it. Nice. Okay. Anything else down here that I need to worry about? So grease, I'm going to use for... the door so it doesn't squeak. We got some 10, 10 W40 here. This should stop it from squeaking. Yes. Yes. Oh. It's the brig. Uh... Oh, good. More inventory. <laughs> More inventory. I Lame. can't get to it. That big ghost's in the way. Can I tickle you too? I don't want to wake him up unless I have some of that anti-ghost potion to defend myself with. I don't want to wake him up unless I have some of that anti-ghost potion to defend myself with. Okay, so then let's go back down the hatch, because we have tools. And see if we can open this crate. This should do it. Could you be a little noisier? Oh, 
I'll just grab this old root and be on my way. Nice. So then we need to take this back to uh, the cannibals, right? Let's find our way out of here. I don't know if we need the head for this or not. A long walk, nope. a brief row, and a short hike later. Thank you. I'm glad I didn't have to go all the way I back. I got the route. Wow. Wow. Oh, he's not kidding. Here it is. He's not such a wimp after all. I'm a mighty pirate. Come on, let's go make the brew of the fermented root. Wait here, we'll be right back. Yes. It's a three-headed monkey. That's crazy. I got the root. <laughs> I don't care. There it is. One squirt of that stuff and the ectoplasm really hits the fan. And if you have any left over, it's delicious with a little vanilla ice cream. Good luck. Thanks. Okay. Let's go. After some more furious paddling. <laughs> oh, no. You scared me half to death. Uh, what happened to the ship? Yeah, where is it? They all left for the wedding. No. No. What wedding? LeChuck is marrying the governor of Melee Island. No, he's not. What? But how will they... Where's the wedding? There's a lovely church on Melee Island. Oh, that's what the church is for. There. Back to Melee. Melee Island? Oh, no. <laughs> Why are you still here? <laughs> May I left you behind? My head fell into the lava there, <laughs> and I had to chase after it. Oh, no. And when I came back, they had gone. You're not appreciated. Shame, too. I hate to miss the wedding. I've got to go after them. I've got to stop that wedding. Bye. <laughs> oh, look oh, who shows there up. there you are. We've been looking all over for you. Mm-hmm. Bob! Hi, Bob. Hi, guys. <laughs> See, Bob, you're looking a little pale. Well, naturally, I'm pale. I am dead, after all. Dead? How did that happen? Oh, the usual way. Out for a day's plunder. Ghost ship shows up. LeChuck kills everybody on the crew. And then signs us up on his ship. You know. Gee, that's too bad. Maybe you'd like to join us on our quest for the perfect tan. Well, that'd be nice, but I am trying to catch a ride to a wedding on Melee Island. We were about to head back there anyway. You can come along. Great! Okay, I kind of wanted to let that run its course so I could hear the story. How did you get in here without using the head? What? Well, well, I mean, that is, you don't seem to have a head, and <laughs> what? Uh-oh. Um, never mind. They're going to shove me in the lava here in a second. You guys know this shambling see-through shade? Did yeah, how do you guys know, Bob? Grip on his head? You've got to get over this obsession with heads, Threepwood. <laughs> All right, let's get back. We've got to get back to Melee Island. We got some no business kidding. to take care of. Yeah, we're out of sunscreen. Come on, let's go.
<laughs> All right, the last part. Guybrush kicks butt. Well, that certainly was easier than the trip to Monkey Island. <laughs> yeah, it was. Wish those guys hadn't been so excited about getting sunscreen. Now I'll have to stop the wedding by myself. Yeah, why do you need sunscreen at night? All right, I guess let's go ahead and do, I was gonna say part four, but that's not what they call it. They call it the last part. So let's do that. We already know where we need to go. We've got to go straight to, uh... Yikes. Whoa. Hey! Wait a second! Uh... Wanna see a neat Wanna trick? Wanna see a neat trick? Gosh, yes! I love magic tricks! Oh. Oh, poor guy. Cool. <laughs> okay, yeah, I don't know what happened there, but, um, yeah, we already know where we need to go. We need to go to the church to stop the wedding. Oh, geez, here's another guy. All right, let's, let's go. Excuse me. Do you have an invitation to the wedding? Yes. <laughs> I must have left it in my other pants. I must have left it in my other pants. Bye now. Not so fast, buddy. You don't look very ghost-like to me. You're very pink. <laughs> uh... I suffer from rare pigmentation efficiency sim syndrome. I suffer from a rare pigmentation efficiency syndrome. You don't sound much like a ghost either. Could you wail and moan or rattle some chains or something? Sure. <laughs> um, I know it wants me to just go ahead and do this and get it done, but I'm kind of wanting to see where the dialogue goes. Oh. <laughs> Can I brush? You sound a lot like my dog. But where's that dank, musty, beyond the grave ghostly smell? Oh, that. Just let me get my boots off. <laughs> no, never mind. If you're really a ghost, prove it. Let's see you pop your head off. Oh. Yikes. Uh, all right, hello. Let's just uh, do this root beer. You mean the head on this root beer? This stuff's great. Yeah, poor guy's just Watch doing his job, though. There's a new sheriff in town, and his name... Hey, I better get to the church. It's a ghost town. Literally. If there be any man with reason, It's me. Uh, people <laughs> should not be united in blissful matrimony. Let him speak now or forever hold his peace. That'd be me. Stop the wedding. Hey, who's that? Uh... I've come to stop you from marrying Governor Marley. Yeah. How do you plan to do that? Oh. Uh, uh where'd you come from? Governor. Governor? <laughs> What's going on? Who's he marrying? Oh, Guybrush, you mad fool! I'm impressed you came to rescue me, but it really wasn't necessary. Yeah, she can take care of herself. I had everything well in hand. Unfortunately, your arrival has made it necessary for me to tip my hand early. Oh, my bad. Oh. Ooh. But what? I thought LeChuck was going to marry you. Yes, yeah, so did I. <laughs> yes, yeah, so did he. <laughs> but I arranged for a little surprise when it came time to kiss the bride. Oh. How did you manage to escape? Oh, that 
was easy. The Chucky's a bozo. Hey. <laughs> and lots of his crew members were friends of mine when they were alive. Oh. If you're here, then who's that in the dress? Is it the monkey? It's the monkey! What? Oh, don't scare them! They have my ghost zapping root beer bottle! It's my ghost zapping root beer bottle. Oops. Ugh, nice going, guy brush. Now I've got to chase them down to get my voodoo root beer back. But I love No oh boy. Hey! You dared come here and confront me? I can't believe your audacity. Well, I can't believe your stupidity. Yeah? Yeah. Well, I can't believe your frivolity. Oh, this is going to be good. <laughs> well, I can't believe your atrocity. Yeah? Well, I can't believe your mobility. Oh, that's not really an insult. Well, I can't believe your enormity. <laughs> well, I can't believe your fragility. Oh. Well, I can't believe your felicity. Ah, I grow tired of you. Aww. Um. Uh oh. Say now. Oh. Well, let's not be hasty. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> oh boy. Lost my root beer. Dang it. Oh. oh! This is called Guybrush Kicks Butt, but I'm actually the one who's getting my butt kicked. Good to see you, son. How's the ship? If you're interested in trading up, I can give you a fair price for it. Sure. Oh. Howdy, partner. You know, just by looking at you, I can tell you're Stan, a man watch of the world. A man with an eye for quality. A man who knows a good bargain when he... Oh, Stan. Ugh. Take that root beer stuff. Oh. <laughs> Instant replay. <laughs> Do it in slow mo. Come on. I love how this game's kind of tongue in cheek about some things. <laughs> Blimp can. <laughs> Oh, this is great. <laughs> Elaine! Oh, don't sneak up on me like that. Sorry. That's okay. Oh. You know, LeChuck was a deep, obnoxious, slithery, creepy, crawly sort of a guy, but I'll say one thing for him. What's that? Sure looks nice against the night sky. <laughs> yeah, he does. Yes. It's very romantic. Can I buy you a root beer? Uh, I want to say I'm sick of root beer, but sure. <laughs> There's more at Stan's. Oh, gosh. I hope Stan's okay. He'll be fine. friend he's got too. I certainly hope he didn't leave without me. Check the note. Well, at least 
least I learned something from all this. What's that? I <laughs> never pay more than 20 bucks for a computer game. <laughs> That's, that's hilarious. Well, the last part didn't take that long at all. That was great, though. That was a really fun game. I like that. I think this is the first game of like a four, five, six game series. So we'll definitely be taking a look at the others uh, in the future. I really liked how the game was, um, tongue in, like I said, tongue in cheek about certain things that, about video game logic, video game lore, and how they kind of make jokes, jokes about it. That was pretty cool. I actually like that a lot. Alright, they didn't have any kind of end screen. Some games do, some games don't. So I, I wasn't sure what they would do. But guys, that's the end. That's the secret of Monkey Island. That game was actually a lot of fun. I really enjoyed it. It was really funny. I had a great time playing it. The puzzles weren't too difficult. I highly recommend that you guys get this game and play it if you haven't. It's a lot of fun. It's a classic for a reason. We'll just put it that way. But anyhow, guys, if you've made it all the way to the end of the video, and especially to the end of the series, thanks so much for hanging around. I really appreciate it. You guys are the absolute best. If you enjoyed it, leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new. Either way, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Oh,